And next we have Trish Johnson's The House That Sam Built, which is a hooked rug in wool on linen. Uh, Trish, are you with us here? Yes. Oh, wonderful. Welcome. Hi. Uh, I thought I'd uh, start at the beginning. Um, I first saw a hooked rug in 1972. I was visiting my aunt in New Brunswick and she was hooking a rug of the blue nose and I filled in a lot of the sky for her. I uh, started hooking my own rugs from my own designs in 1990 and I started with a series of rugs that document the places my family has called home. I've hooked about six rugs of Grand Manan. This rug is uh, one of the six of Grand Manan. Uh, my grandmother was born in Grand Manan and brought up on two lighthouses. She told me a lot of stories about Grand Manan and uh, that started my interest in family history a long time ago. Uh, so the piece I have in Fiberworks is called The House That Sam Built. And uh, it's um, a house that was built by my ancestor, Sam Harvey. He's my third great grandfather, but the house is still there. I didn't know about this house until uh, 2018. I discovered this house uh, after I had my DNA analyzed by uh, Ancestry.com. And I got a list of uh, new relatives and only one of them on the list had the same surname as my grandmother, John Harvey. So I emailed him and I said, are you a Harvey from Grandma and Ann? And he said he was. And so we became Facebook friends. And then I arrived in Grandma and Ann the summer of 2018. And I went to the uh, lobster roll dinner at the church hall. And someone said to me, are you Trish Johnson? And I said, yes, I was. And that was how I met John Harvey. He invited me to his house, and I had a tour of the house. Um, and it's built by our mutual ancestor, Sam Harvey. Uh, John Harvey's my third cousin. Yeah, <laughs> one generation removed. He's one generation younger than me. <laughs> anyway, um, mostly I do like uh, landscapes. Uh, the uh, painter, uh, J.W. Turner said a landscape was a spatial thrill, and I think that too. I love a big wide open sky. I um, like a rug that tells a story. This uh, house, um, I had a tour of it, dates from about 1880. And in the attic, you can see the um, hand, the marks uh, of the axe uh, the, on the hand hewn beams. He was, a, Sam Harvey was a boat builder. He went to Grand Manan from Nova Scotia to build boats for another ancestor of mine. <laughs> but he was a boat builder and a carpenter. On Grand Manan, it's unusual not to be a fisherman. Uh, I admire the simple construction of these houses. Uh, and uh, I thought I'd say a little bit about hook rugs in general, in case uh, you aren't familiar with them. Uh, they're hooked with uh, wool yardage. I have a piece here <laughs> and uh, I hand dye all of the pieces to get a certain color that I want. And then the, the uh, wool is cut into little uh, strips with a cutter. You could cut them with the scissors. In the old days, they cut them with the scissors. And then they're pulled through a piece of uh, linen with a little uh, tool like a crochet hook. And I have a hook that um, was my great-grandmother's uh, and her brother made it for her. It's the uh, tine of a pitchfork bent and put in a handle. And uh, I think for most of my rugs are story rugs and I'm glad the show is up and I hope to see it in person soon. Thank you. Thank you, Trish. We hope to see you in person at the gallery as well.